Hi guys, now I have to re-record this video as I was trying to sort of <laughs> clean up my YouTube channel, no, cleaning up my house, trying to, you know, as I told you, I keep explaining it, I was going to relocate my house to somewhere else, to, you know, and obviously everything, sort of, well I'm not, <laughs> and um, so I'm sort of trying to sort out my own house where I'm living as well as everything else and sort of clean up my YouTube channel and I accidentally deleted the whole playlist for Fruits at Point Cancer and I'm talking quiet because it's late at night and I've had to put this mushroom video out there again and you know I'm going to have to re sort of go back to my database and try and you know so it's very un sort of conventional and well spoken of and you know I just have to put it out there again because you know I think really think it's important to and um, the mushroom obviously you know as I told you it's very you know unconventional alternative medicine and you know I really believe in alternative medicine so you know I have to put it out there because I um, hold on to my integrity and what I believe in and as you know a mushroom has a very you know a magical ingredient that helps for cancer and um, you know, it's, it's just the best out there so anyway as you know the atom of a mushroom if you look at it is very similar well more identical to cancer cells and if you look at it like this that bit there is a stem and never cut off the stems of mushroom never mind what the government tell us about cutting them off and also if you can get organic because I've found that mushrooms that come in that plastic stuff it was not totally disgusting I have some to show you but I'm going to tomorrow make a more detailed video but this is just quick so anyway so that is the mushroom and that is you know more or less identical atom to the cancer cells now cancer cells as you know spread very quickly mushrooms grow very quickly and what it is is they attach each other to the stems and they sort of spread with red and it's like wildfire and it's very hard to control but um, there's an ingredient in the mushroom that halts them from actually spreading they, so they lie dormant so they can't do you any damage ever again as long as you eat plenty of them so what it is is the mushroom as it, you know when it's growing they cannot if you you know it's got this ingredient so they just cannot attach themselves to each other as quickly if you you know look at it in that sort of concept and I will make this video better and I'll try to tomorrow to explain it a bit more just have to tell you I've got to say it again really fast because I want to make this video because I've said I've deleted my videos and I have to say about the mushrooms but I, I want to keep them simple that's all you need to know to eat mushroom you don't need to know the ins and outs really do you, you know <laughs> But, you know, can any, as I said, organic's best, and the big fat mushrooms are the best ones, I really believe they are the best ones, so I've heard. So, you know, that's what I just wanted to put out there. So, um, you know, you know, is, you know, just going by sort of this scientific evidence that it does work is enough. You know, as I said, the hospitals don't tell us about alternative medicine. They don't believe in it because pharmaceutical companies make absolutely no money out of it. So what's in it for them? They don't care. And that's why I want to say this in a kind of Russell Brandish kind of way. Not be so boring. Um, do it in a fun way. Not make cancer sound so depressing and and all this. Even though it's not really, really serious. But I just believe the government aren't doing enough, really. You know, when there's other alternative, unconventional, you know, has to be said. But, you know, we don't have to, we've been around for millions of years without hospitals and um, modern day medicine man. So why not try alternative medicine? That's what's been keeping us going all these years, mother nature, you know. And um, everything that's around us growing naturally, you know, the mushrooms. And so why would, you know got to be you know give it a whirl <laughs> I've even got some more nut whips somewhere so I thought 
it's going to be a good video. Better, well, <laughs> hopefully better than this one. This is just quick because I have to touch. It's <laughs> a mushroom. But, uh, yeah, I wanted to explain again why the mushroom video has suddenly disappeared. A puff of, puff of smoke gone <laughs> into the night. But I'm sorry about that. I'm really sorry, but I want to make a video really quick. So I'm talking what looks it's like not. But I want to say, you know, please, you know, don't give up on the mushrooms. And I'll record this video tomorrow and explain it hopefully better if you want to know it's scientific, you know. Um, but all you need to know is to eat mushrooms because, as I said, they have an ingredient that makes it lie dormant, so it can't ever hurt you, you know. What is the, what you got you lose, what have you got to lose, and obviously the neem, neem seed oil, hemp seed oil, H E M P, which is derived from marijuana, and it comes in a capsule you can get for literally. Twelve pound P and P from Amazon. You know, there's so much I can speak about. You know, and I want to put it out there. And please watch. You know, and I know even though I don't get involved with any social interaction because I, I have got a life, and I don't need to you know, keep. That's explaining myself why I don't get involved with anything to do with the internet. I just want to make videos, and so. You know, spread the word about alternative medicine really so <laughs> thanks for watching this video and please you know give it a whirl because what have we got to lose and as i said it's very controversial but you know i just believe in it and you know i really think that alternative medicine is the answer because it's been around for so long you know when we was cavemen you know we had tea tree oil back for years and i still use it on my skin but, you know if I use modern day man medicine, I'll get rashes and everything. I have to use um, gentle, and that's another thing <laughs> I want to speak about is beauty and using you know, natural remedies for that. So I'm going to go because I'm going on. So I'll see you tomorrow and hope you're going to you know, carry on watching my videos. So thank you ever so much, everyone. Ciao for now.